We are at, sitting at Warm Creek Bay, right outside of Bear Lake, Utah. We hope you really enjoy this video. If you haven't subscribed already, please subscribe. Yes, and like. We really appreciate it. Thank you. So we've been heading down a dirt road for a while. I'll uh, point it out on the map, which will give you an idea of where we're heading to. And then I'll show you a little bit of the driving that we're experiencing, which is right in the canyon. It's really cool. So here's Big Water. We've been traveling down this road. And now we're down, going down this road, trying to get to Warm Creek Bay. It's um, not a paved road, as you'll see. It's, it's quite hacked in, but it's very, very neat. Here's where we're sitting right now, just so I could show you the map. And here's the road. Wow, is this incredible or what? It's a big rock fall off the over one flat truck. Yes. Wow. This is great. Just bend after bend of pure gorgeous. Is there a convenience store down here when we get here? <laughs> Probably not. <laughs> yet but this is the road leading into it well, thanks to J-Rod's great driving we made it here's our canopy that we got from Danny at CVT. Thanks a lot, Danny. We really appreciate it. It is working awesome out here. Protect us from uh, this blazing 110 degrees. J-Rod's had a toothache for two days. He's taking amoxicillin and a strong dose of ibuprofen. So he hasn't been feeling well. Arizona. Today J-Rod and I were just talking about did I want to drive because literally he's been driving this whole trip and I said well I don't really want to unless you need me to. I've just liked being a passenger. It's been really nice. So thank you J-Rod for all your driving. I really appreciate it but you do get some neck rubs and back rubs here and there don't you? Yep. Arm rubs, little head rubs. Yep. So he benefits from that. So I'd say that's pretty good. And we have been spending so much time in the West right now because of two big things. Our daughter Corinna got J-Rod some appointments with a dentist and he's waiting for the permanence to come in. Well, that takes like three weeks. So we've been spending time in the West until he can get back into the dentist by Corinna's to get them finished. I have been getting a tattoo removed. I got this tattoo, let's see. It, it's one on my upper chest area. <laughs> I have been going to get it lasered at, by a doctor at our daughter's also. So this is my second treatment and I don't think I'm gonna need another one, but I kinda gotta see what happens. This is. This was second treatment was just done a week ago today. And so I, it, as it's falling off, it's literally coming off and taking the tattoo away. But it's not quite done healing, so, and it could take up to four weeks. Why are you getting rid of that tattoo? I just, I never liked this tattoo. I was gonna get this real tiny tattoo, and this was done when I was 19 years old. And I was gonna get this really tiny tattoo, but instead I got a bigger tattoo that a friend of mine designed. And I hate to say this, but once it was put on, I've literally never really liked it. I'm 49 years old, so I've literally 
I couldn't even, you couldn't even really read it. It had both my son's names in it. I had two sons at the time already by that age, and you couldn't even really make out the names. So I've had this tattoo for 30 years. I was going to cover it up in LA when we were visiting our daughter, but she talked me into just going and having it removed by her doctor. Uh, a big thank you to Corinna for that and for um, J-Rod's teeth. So that's been a real blessing to both of us and we really appreciate it. She does a lot of kind things for not only us, but other family members and other people in general. She's very giving. And so we both really appreciate that. In the next two weeks or so, we'll once his veneers are done, we'll be heading back home for a week or so because we have some events going on. Our grandson's two year birthday. So we're going to go to that. Then we're gonna be heading south to Florida, which we're really excited about that. So you'll be seeing some cool videos on that. Taking the boat. And we are taking our boat, which is gonna be awesome. We're gonna to go to Destin and head down to the Keys, uh, to Key West, and just visit some awesome places. So we'll be having a lot of video, a lot of videos on all that. And when J-Rod mentioned even doing a YouTube channel, I was like, no way. We're not doing one because I'm not photogenic. I don't even like pictures of myself, and yet, here we are on video. So, anyway, I guess, comes a point, 49 years old, gotta get over myself. So, trying to do that, and give you guys some content you would like, and enjoy watching. And remember to subscribe to our video if you haven't already, and turn on notifications if you'd like to see those, and uh, like our videos. Thanks, guys.